everybody. Okay, I'm making this video response for my daughter, who, if anyone doesn't know, is at Daughter of Bible Girl 7. And for anyone else who doesn't know, yeah, Bible Girl 7 is my main account. Um, okay. She did a video called Would You Rather, and she has five questions that you have to answer Would You Rather, and she gives you two answers, and you have to choose only one. And I take no responsibility for these questions. I have no idea how she came up with these. <laughs> okay, so question number one. If you were a Siamese twin and you were... They don't call it that anymore, do they? I think they call it conjoined twins now. I think Siamese twin has become obsolete. Okay, I'm pretty sure. So, all right, let's, I'm going to do it right. So say conjoined twin, if you're a conjoined twin. And you were joined the leg, like all the way down your leg, would you rather spend your life joined to your twin or live with only one leg? Okay, my answer is going to be live with only one leg. However, I want to know why the twin can't be the one to live with only one leg. Why do I have to be the one to only have one leg, you know? I'm just saying. <laughs> That's terrible, isn't it? Okay, next question. Would you rather fall out of a car that's traveling 40 miles an hour or have a car run over your foot? Okay, I'm going with foot. Even though I was kind of thinking, what if it crushed all the bones in your foot? But I guess that's better than falling out of the car at 40 miles an hour. That's, that's kind of fast. That could do some serious damage. All right, this next question. Again, I take no responsibility. I don't know where she came up with these. <laughs> this is just bizarre. Would you rather not eat for a week or not poop for a week? Yeah. Okay, I'm just going to go with not eat for a week and just not even elaborate on all the th thoughts that run through my head with that one. <laughs> okay, question number four. Would you rather, if you won $1 million, have the government take it all from you or have to spend it all to get out of debt? I'm going to almost have to spend it all to get out of debt because um, if you had to spend it all to get out of debt and you actually had that much debt, obviously you've got to have some pretty cool stuff somewhere. So at least you're paying back something that you already got. And if the gov Of course, if the government took it from you, that would mean you had to have made a lot of money if you actually owed a million dollars. Okay, I'm going to get out of debt because I'm hopefully going to have some really cool stuff if I had a million dollars worth of debt. <laughs> okay, last question. Would you rather wake up to find that your house had been flooded or wake up to find millions of roaches crawling all over you? Okay, I'm going with wake up to find my house flooded just because roaches... <laughs> I guess it just creeps me out just thinking about it. Even though her and I actually had a conversation earlier and she had a good point that, you know, roaches, you could just kill them and brush them off of you, whereas if your house is flooded, it could take, like, years to get all your stuff back or what if you didn't have flood insurance and she really analyzed this. But um, I think I'm still going with flooded because I just can't stand roaches. Okay, so that's my video response for my daughter on Would You Rather. <laughs> Bye.